वेलकम बैक टू इजी इंजीनियरिंग बाय नेहा सैयद टुडेज टॉपिक दैट वी आर गोइंग टू सी इज एन आईपी एड्रेस दैट इज एन इंटरनेट प्रोटोकॉल एड्रेस सो व्हाट इज एन आईपी एड्रेस वी कैन से दैट इट इज एन यूनिक एड्रेस दैट इज यूज्ड टू आइडेंटिफाई डिवाइसेस ऑन द इंटरनेट इन एक्चुअल वी कैन से दैट आईपी एड्रेस आर द आइडेंटिफायर्स इट आर द आइडेंटिफायर्स दैट अलाउज द इंफॉर्मेशन टू बी सेंड बिटवीन द डिवाइसेस ऑन द network so now uh, let's uh, try to uh, understand it with the help of example uh, for example if you want to uh, do anything on the internet like emailing or downloading a file your computer must have an your computer must have an address similarly your destination should also have an address in properly to deliver the data to the proper destination uh yeah, if we don't have the unique address obviously the data cannot be transferred to this computer we want the data to be transferred to this particular computer so we can do this with the help of an ip address uh just take an example if you want to do uh, we can take the example of parser or the courier that you want to send uh if you want to send a, uh, this courier or a parcel to the particular destination we should have uh, or we should need an address of that particular destination in the same way the ip address is used to identify that particular devices on the internet to send the data to that respective destination uh, in short uh, it is a network address for your computer we can say that in short it is a network address for your computer laptops or any other networking devices that is used now and each computer or each device in all the world has an unique ip address so that it can be sent to the proper destination now what does this ip stands for ip stands for internet protocol what is this we can say that it is a set of rules governing how the data Set, uh, how the data could be sended in which format the data can be sended using this protocol how the data is going to be sent or it is going to be received now what is uh, how this ip address looks like it is a string of numbers in a particular return in a particular format or you can say in a certain format like for example in this way uh, it ranges actually from 000 to Two five five. It is the range for the IP address. Uh, actually, this is the uh, format, or you can say that these addresses are actually assigned by IANA. This is nothing but the Internet Corporation for the Internet Assigned Numbers Authority. It is the one who are going to assign the unique IP addresses to all the devices, so that it is an unique. because no two devices can have the same addresses now let's see what are the various versions of ip addresses there are two main versions that is ipv4 and ipv6 now what is an ipv4 ipv4 is a version 4 whereas ipv6 is an version 6 now what is an ipv4 it is nothing but a 32 bit address it is unique universally used for defining the connection of the devices like your computers and routers but the address bits are the 32 bit long and how many addresses we can have or how many address space we can have for the ipv4 is the 2 raised to 32 uh, you can say that almost 4 billion almost 4 billion addresses can be used in the ipv4 whereas in the ipv6 it has 128 bit address uh, and you can say that it address space for this is 2 raised to 128 128 eight bit address it has and address space is 2 raised to 128 uh, so to make the addresses more reachable ip uh, ipv6 uses hexadecimal colon notation it uses hexadecimal colon notation uh, unlike the ipv4 now uh, there are actually uh, various uh, i actually i am going to make the videos uh, detailed videos on ipv4 and ipv6 what are the difference what are the protocols used in ipv4 and what are the formats or the what are the headers for this so uh, stay tuned or please subscribe my channel so you get the notification for this now we will see what are the various types of ip addresses 
so there are two main types of uh, ip addresses that is the private address and a public address what is in private address a device is connected to the home network or the private network has a private ip addresses you can say that it is a non internet facing ip addresses whereas public ip addresses what is this this public ip addresses are directly assigned by the your internet service provider which enables your routers actually to communicate with the internet or the uh you can say outside our the uh, actually outside our network which uh, uh, enable the router to communicate now uh, public ip address you can say that it is uh, you classified or uh, uh, more uh, divided into two addresses that is the static ip address and the dynamic ip address uh, static ip address obviously uh, this is static it is not going to be changed once assigned Uh, once we assign the address it is never going to be changed whereas the dynamic ip addresses is keeps changing continuously it keeps changing every time you connect to the internet new ip address is assigned to us so that's why it is called as a dynamic ip address and this both falls under the public ip address and the private which is not going to face to the outside world or you can say that uh, not facing to the uh, directly not facing to the ip address it is the private addresses that is provided to us now this is in the simple way uh, we can say that how the ip address is defined or uh, how the ip address actually works now ip address you you have to remember it is an unique identifier or entity for identifying the address for the networking devices to us thank you